Hello people of YouTube and beyond, my name is Jamie Hayes and welcome back to another video. Now in this video, as you can see, I am finally, finally playing Minecraft, which is something that I've wanted to do pretty much ever since I started the channel. Um, so yeah, I, I absolutely love this game and I'm somewhat of a veteran at it. It's one, honestly one of my favourite games. Um, so anyway, yeah, I have wanted to do a series on this for so long and this totally isn't my third time trying to record this video. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm playing on PlayStation 4, as you can see right there, um, and my younger brother clued me into a way that I can record videos on here and upload them onto my channel, which will be good. Um, so I'm just going to get straight in and um, I'm going to create a new world. Um, look, as you can see, I do have a few worlds on here because I do like to play in my spare time, but we're going to create a new world. Um, and I have no idea what to call it, so for now I'm just going to call it Let's Play World. Um, and if we have, if I end up actually fucking uploading this video, um, then if we get some, uh, ah, bloody, ugh, I can't concentrate on two things at once. If I get any name suggestions for what else to call the world, let me know in the comments down below, um, and maybe this world name will change. Right, let's play world. And I really, like, after recording a few videos before, I know that you can't see the keyboard when it shows up when I do that, so it just suddenly changes. But anyway, yeah, let's play world. That's what I'm going to keep it as for now, unless I figure out a better name to call it. And we're going to go in survival, easy. Um, I did consider doing an amplified world, because I have an amplified world on this, which basically, it says it there. Um, it basically, the entire world is like an extreme hills biome. It's like, it's huge. Like, there's really big mountains and deep valleys and all of this sort of thing. And it is di more difficult to survive in than a normal world. So I decided to not bother with that for the Let's Play. I'm just going to do a normal box standard world for the Let's Play. Large world, medium biomes. Uh, I'm going to have generate structures on because I do eventually want to try and defeat the Ender Dragon on this world. We will have to see how that goes. Uh, I'm not going to cheat with the bonus chest and I don't want a super flat because I only ever use them for uh, creative worlds. And I'm going to leave those as are, as is. Um, so yeah, let's just get straight into it. Um, I don't want to, like, faff around and just, you know, stall for time or whatever. I want to just get straight into it. Because, like I said, this is the third time I've tried to do this. And I really, really hope it works. Um, but yeah, I am so excited to be able to play Minecraft on the channel. Um, I feel like it's probably going to be a lot of fun. Um... And like I said, I have loved this game ever since I first got introduced to it, and it's so cool. Um, yeah, like I said, I was kind of like a veteran when I first started, um, and then I kind of stopped playing. Oh, I'm in a tree. <laughs> um, anyway, first thing I need to do is get some wood. Oh, I'm in a birch biome. Uh, oh, this is... Oh my god, this is so cool. This is possibly the perfect place to spawn. Um, yeah, anyway, so, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, uh, I used to be a Minecraft veteran, um, and I was, I would hazard a guess and say I've been playing for maybe six, seven years, something like that. I'm not entirely sure. Um, but yeah, I first got introduced to it, and, um, yeah, so I haven't been there since the beginning or anything like that, but I've been here for a long time. I've known about Minecraft and played Minecraft for a long time, um, and yeah, I do really enjoy it. Um, and I kind of stopped playing for a little bit after the aquatic update. Um, after that, I kind of stopped playing as much uh, because, well, I didn't really have access to it. Um, so after the aquatic update, I did kind of stop playing a little bit, but uh, now I'm back. Um, and it, so obviously it has taken a little bit of getting used to um, with like some of the updates that have come out since then. Like, the uh, the village and pillage update has come out since I last played, and that took some getting used to. Like, all of these updates that have come out since the last time I played have taken some getting used to. And I am trying not to repeat myself, but it's not going very well. As you may or may not be able to tell, I am slightly flustered because playing games and commentating is not something that I'm used to. It's something I've always wanted to do. But I've never tried it before, so I'm not exactly used to it. Um, but yeah, the first thing I need to do is, I've got my tools, now I just need to work on trying to get a bed. Just so that I can survive the first night, and then I will start thinking about trying to make a base. Um, 
like and i i want to i want to just get straight in and make a permanent base um because sometimes what i tend to do is i tend to like maybe find like a little cave or basically sometimes in some cases i have literally dug myself a hole um and turned that into my base but i don't really want to do that this time i just oh that was glitching out <laughs> Yeah, I I don't want to do that this time. I just want to get straight in and find somewhere that I can have a permanent base. Um, because I feel like that would probably be quite cool to establish that, that uh, that's the first thing in the series kind of thing. I don't know. Excuse me, I'm burping. Um, and for this series, I am trying to take inspiration from some popular YouTubers that I've been watching who have been playing Minecraft recently. I'm going to go over here. Um, I am trying to take inspiration from them, um, and, you know, as to, like, sort of, I mean, they've been, the YouTubers that I watch that are now starting to play Minecraft have been doing it for years, you know, they have a big following, um, so clearly they're doing something right, so I'm taking inspiration from them while also at the same time trying to put my own spin on it, um, because there's not really much point trying to be someone I'm not just to get views because I know people who do that and it's it's not good um, so I do want to try and be myself but I want to take inspiration from these big youtubers and do things that they have done that made them successful if that makes any sense um, and also I do want to try not to ramble too much because um, like I said commentating and gaming is not something that I'm used to anyway <laughs> right I'm gonna Stop with that frickin' tangent. Die. <laughs> oh, there's horses over here, and I really, really want one. I mean, I could tame them, but I don't have saddles or anything, or leads or anything like that. So I could tame them, but I... <laughs> Ugh. Like, this is another thing. I want all of the animals. I want a dog, a cat, a horse, a parrot. I want all of the possible tameable animals that you can get. I want all of them. <laughs> this is what I always do. Um... You know, I always go on a quest to get as many pets as I possibly can. Um, so, yeah, we'll, we'll, we will have to see. Maybe I might get more than one of each. We'll see. Um, speaking of, there's a wolf. There's wolves right fucking here. God damn. If I had the stuff, I would come and tame you. And I would make you love me forever. <laughs> uh, and also, that's a point. I need to think of names for my future pets. Because it's inevitable. I'm going to get dogs and cats. Right, I want to get plenty of wood because actually this looks like a really, really good place to start a base. I mean, I kind of want to have a look around and see if I can find somewhere better. But this looks like a really good spot, like this nice flat area. Alright, I'm going to gather a little bit more wood because I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to see me gathering wood this entire episode. <laughs> right. <sighs> Fucking go over there. Jesus Christ. Yeah, the PS4 controls uh, have taken some getting used to as well. Um, even though I am predominantly a console gamer, like I'm used to playing it on PlayStation. <coughs> Sorry. Oh, my axe is already dead nearly. Right, I need food. And I don't even care that I'm slaughtering these pigs. Like, normally people are like, oh no, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to kill you. I don't give a shit, I need food. <laughs> Your sacrifice was not in vain. <laughs> Right, yeah, I'm starting to build up stuff now. Oh, horsey. I, I, oh, baby! Oh, that's so cute. There's a little baby. Oh, my God. Anyway, I'm going to head over to this desert biome and see what's going on. Because um, I'm going to want some cacti later down the line. Give me you. Yeah, they they updated the textures. Um, like, the, the spikes on the cacti used to be black. And now they're white. Which is weird. Alright, well, I will keep you. Oh, cows. I need food. And I might need leather later as well. Actually, if I get enough leather from these guys, maybe I could make some sort of armour. I only got one piece of leather from all of that. I killed three cows and only got one piece of leather, you stingy bastards. <laughs> Alright, so we've got a desert biome here. We've got an extreme hills over there, acacia over there, more desert over there, more acacia over there. Uh, what looks like a lake the oh shit <laughs> um i've got the birch biome that i came from and a forest over there i think i'm gonna go this way 
Um, I kind of, I don't know, I can't, I don't know if I want to go too far from the spawn or not. Um, floating sand block. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know if I want to go too far from the spawn, um, because, like, if I die, oh, there's a swamp biome over here, cool. Yeah, if I die, then I'm screwed. Oh, sheep, that was what I was doing, I need to make a bed. And unfortunately, I don't have shears, so I'm going to have to kill you. I'm sorry. I do like the fact, though, that sheep give you meat now. That was an update that's been in the game for a while, but I'm so glad they give you meat. as Because they used to just give you wool, which was kind of shit, really. You, didn't, you couldn't get anything else off them. But now they give you mutton, which is great. Right, in that case, I need more sheep. I need one more. And I need to cook some of the food that I've got. Because I'm starting to run low on hunger. Well... Right, I hope that you'd think there would be more sheep around here because I just found some here. Let's have a look. I didn't. Well, I think so. Well, look, look, see, there's a cow there. Sometimes cattle spawn in swamp biomes. I think cattle spawn in pretty much any biome, really. Right. Oh. I'm so tempted to just literally dig... Actually, yeah, I am. I'm going to do it. I'm going to dig up some cobblestone. Oh, fucking... There's a drowned dude there. I'm going to dig up some cobblestone, make a thing. Ooh, llamas. Cool. And there's... Oh, there's a grey sheep up there, which doesn't really help me, because I've got white wool. Unless I turn on classic crafting. I've got classic crafting on. Oh. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is not going well. <laughs> right. You stay right fucking there. I do not want to have to deal with you. Oh, honestly, the drowned dudes, they sound so gross. They sound like someone is gargling or choking or something. It's so gross. I really, I don't like the sounds they make. See, can you hear that? Oh, ugh, ugh. Sends shivers down my spine. Yeah, I've got fucking classic crafting on. It doesn't matter what sheep I kill. Because I can just make a bed anyway. Actually, I don't think I'll actually be able to do that because they implemented, like, um, coloured beds. Oh, my axe broke. Yeah, they implemented coloured beds, so you can't mix colours, I don't think. I mean, I will try it. And if it fails, then I'll just have some random grey wool that I don't need. Hello, pig. My siblings used to, like, condemn me for killing pigs because they were like, no, don't kill them, they're cute. I'm like, I don't care. I need food. <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm burping. Right, let's see if this will work. I don't think it will. Nope. Uh, you used to be able to do that. And it's getting night as well, which is a pain in my ass. Llamas. Oh, I need to find one more sheep, one more white sheep, and then I'm good. Oh, this is what I hate about fucking extreme hills biomes. They are so hard to traverse and to climb. It's such a pain in the ass. More alpacas? Alpacas are not what I need. I need sheep. Unless alpacas give you wool, which they don't. Fucking... Ugh. Ooh, cool. Oh, awesome. There's another flat bit there. In fact, I think that is where I'm going to make my base. Because there's dark oak here. Uh, this dark oak forest, whatever you call it. Um, and I absolutely love dark oak. It's one of my favourite woods to use. And I need to stop breaking my ankles because I can't eat and I can't heal. Oh, there's, oh, this is perfect. There's dark oak. There's spruce over there. There's oak and birch over there. Oh, this is perfect. Because I love using all different types of wood. And berries, cool. Right, in that case, I'm going to get a bunch of these um, so that I can eat something. Oh no! Oh no! Oh god. I heard that and I was still eating and I was going to run away but I didn't think quick enough. Oh, Jesus Christ, a bloody creeper exploded behind me. I, I fucking hate when that happens, when they just sneak up behind you and you just hear the hissing, and it's by the time you realise what's going on, it's too late. Oh, fuck me, that scared me. 
I, I need to make sure to grab plenty of these berries because they only give you one hunger back and I need full hunger to be able to regen. Oh, there's wolves over here. This is going to be perfect when I want to get a dog later. Oh, this is uh, fucking... This is kind of pretty with the... Oh, well, watch yourself, you silly idiot. <laughs> you could be my pet. You are just as stupid as I am. <laughs> anyway, I need a sheep. Give me a fucking goddamn sheep. All right, uh, I need these. That's the thing with these bloody berries. They're so prickly. Right, sheep. Oh, there's horses. There's white horses. I absolutely fucking love white horses. They're so pretty. They are my favourite kind of horse in this game. Oh, my God. I hope this little group stays here long enough that I can find stuff to tame them with. Right, anyway, I need a sheep. This is not going well. I'm th I think maybe if I can't go to sleep I might just like have to carry on through the night like gather more resources and stuff but there's mobs everywhere and I do not want them to kill me right okay oh no I broke my axe god damn it <sighs> this is not going well Yeah, and I do apologise if I just, like, there are periods where I'm just quiet and not saying anything. Like I said, I, I'm i still getting used to the whole commentating and gaming thing. Oh, music, yay. <laughs> I love the music in this game, it's so peaceful. And some of the music discs are really nice as well. Well, some of them are, some of them are fucking freaky. But the disc 11 and disc 13 are really fucking weird. I did actually watch a game theory video on on the background bet like behind those discs and why they're so weird. Um, which I thought was pretty cool. This is the things one thing you don't really realise a lot of the time is that Minecraft has lore. Uh, like it is a story based game. It has a story and it has lore to it. Which not a lot of people tend to realise. Give me you. Right, um, it's skeletons I want, really. Oh, God. Right, I'm thinking I'll just try and set up a little base here for now in amongst these horses. Oh, sheep! Oh, my God, perfect. Right, I need to make a bed, and then I can sleep. Oh, no, creeper. Oh, God, no! I am not well-equipped enough to deal with you! Oh, I didn't mean to go into third person. You literally just... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not good. Oh, God. They're all after me. Oh, fuck me. Oh, I've got all of the mobs after me. Oh, my God. There's a witch. There's zombies. There's creepers. This is not good. Oh, no. She's giving me fucking slowness. Don't you hurt my horses, you little shit. I hate witches. They are such a pain in my ass. I'm gonna fucking die, aren't I? All right, eat, 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 eat. I need to have full hunger so I can regen. Oh, I don't think poison kills you, does it? Oh, hello, you're in the floor. Yeah, no, um, poison doesn't kill you, I don't think. It just leaves you with half a fucking heart. Right, you were the one I was trying to kill. Bastard! Ah! Oh. Right, which way did I go? I went towards the desert biome, didn't I? Ooh, sapling's cool. Yeah, you can tell this is where I was. Right, uh, desert. Where the fuck is the desert from here? It's over there. Oh my god. Seriously? I died on the first fucking night. And I was bloating earlier about how I'm a fucking veteran. Clearly fucking not if I die on the first goddamn night. <sighs> no, seriously, I haven't died on the first night in fucking ages. Like, seriously. Right, and I went this way, didn't I? Oh no, don't shoot me. I've got nothing to defend myself. Fuck off. Oh, I'm hoping I can get back there before all my stuff despawns because I had food and all sorts. 
Oh my god, I can't believe that fucking happened. Oh. Oh yeah, you're like a desert zombie. Alright, I really hope there's nothing following me. Right, I had to go through the swamp. Oh my god, I can't believe that happened. Seriously. I have not died on the first night in literally years. How the... F what the fuck? Oh my god. It's because I'm recording, I bet. I bet it's because I'm recording. I'm just, like, not used to it. So I'm getting all flustered and doing things that I wouldn't normally do. Alright, I have to go through here. This is the thing. In normal bog-standard vanilla Minecraft, when you die, you've got to find your way back to your stuff. Which is something that I don't always end up doing, because sometimes I leave keep inventory on, and sometimes I just, like, cheat. Um, but no, this time I'm not cheating. But this is the pain in the ass with not cheating. <laughs> but I, want, I wanted to, this playthrough to be authentic. Right, where the fuck is my stuff? Right, um, I placed my crafting table down, didn't I? Yes, I did. So my stuff is around here. There it is. Perfect. Right, my sword is what I want. Right, I don't know how much health a spider has and I'm uh, twatting you with a stick. Fuck off! Seriously. Oh, I've got my pickaxe. I can attack you with my pickaxe. Jesus Christ. Oh, no. It's starting to get fucking daylight now, isn't it? I'm just going to do like a ring around the rosy sort of thing with you. Right, go back into the hole your brother made. I've got my pickaxe. I haven't got my sword. Right. Jesus Christ. Oh, okay, so my sword is there. Jesus fucking... Fuck me. I do apologise for all of the swearing as well. I mean, I don't know why I'm apologising, because this is what I do. I swear a lot. Um, but yeah. Can you not... Right, let, can I grab the rest of my stuff now? Jesus Christ, now, let me craft a goddamn bed. I mean, there's no point sleeping now, but... Thank you, right. So, um... I'm gonna... Oh, oh, bollocks! I did not mean to do that. Anyway... Fucking hell. Oh, tiny baby horse. So cute. Right, so I'm going to make a chest to dump all of my stuff in. And then I'm going to start making a house, I think. Right, all of you, all of you can go in there. Until I figure out what the fuck I'm doing. What the fuck? Did you see that? The horse just like lurched into the hole for some reason. Oh, the baby pushed it. Oh my god, that's so cute. Right, uh, I want to make some charcoal. The, the horses are having a great time in the hole. <laughs> Look at this shit. They're loving that. Right. I'm going to see if I can patch up this hole. So I'm afraid you guys are going to have to move. Oh, you are so cute. I'm hoping if I stay close enough to these horses, they won't despawn, so I can eventually tame one of them. I mean, I'm thinking I might just tame one anyway, and then hopefully it won't wander off. Maybe if I go fishing, I might maybe be able to get a uh, name tag, which you can actually sometimes get from fishing. Um, and if I put a name tag on them, they won't despawn, as far as I'm aware. And I am going to end up doing some terraforming, as in, like, flattening the land and all of this. This is just the beginning. <sighs> another thing that I noticed with, like, well, another thing that I should have expected, really, with an amplified world is that terraforming is a pain in the ass. 
Like, I, uh, I've, on my Amplified World, I just recently terraformed a fuck ton of land, and it took forever. It took literally about three hours to do. And I probably should have anticipated it, but, oh my god, it took so long. Because this is another thing that I like to do, is do, I, like, I like to do terraforming um, to make the land nice and flat. And I also get rid, I usually get rid of a load of the seeds. Um, partly, well, no, the grass even. Partly so I can get seeds to do, to make a farm with. And also because I just don't like the way it looks. Alright. I'm not going to go too crazy with it right now. Uh, most of the terraforming that I end up doing is probably going to be off, ca off camera. Because I don't want to bore you with that shit. Alright, let's fix these holes. I don't, this isn't a creeper hole, but I'm going to fix it anyway because I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming in here, fucking wrecking the local ecosystem. <laughs> taking this world for, like, looting it for all it's worth. Taking all of the resources. I've got one block of dirt left. Ooh, there's a trader. Cool. Um, yeah, that's another thing. Wandering traders spawn in uh, within the vicinity of the player, like always. So he will probably be spawning in uh, random points around my base. Right, I don't want to attack your llamas. I want to get rid of this. What have you got? Ooh, jungle tree. Sea pickle, glowstone, lily pad, red sandstone, and packed ice. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> All of the stuff you're selling would have been useful in my other world. But it's not useful to me right now. Because I don't, yeah, I don't need it right now. Oh, thank fuck, I have some proper food. Right, food always goes there. Right, um... What else am I doing? I need to start building my goddamn base. Oh, my shovel broke. I do need to maybe start thinking about making, like, stone tools. And eventually, obviously, iron tools. Um, but just for now, I'll probably end up doing stone. Right, so, house, which is the main reason that I'm doing this. So, let's see how much wood I have. A decent amount, actually. You know what? Right, you're still over there with your mother. I'm going to fucking tame you. I don't even care. Because if I tame you, hopefully that will decrease your risk of despawning. And then as soon as I get a saddle, I can, like, you can be mine and we can go on adventures together. Right, come on. This is the problem with taming horses. It can take a while. And this is why. Come on. Move your ass. Alright, fuck you. I'm going to collect these apples and stuff. That's the thing as well, if I get enough saplings, then I can replant them and eventually maybe get a tree farm going. Right, well, I'm going to replant these anyway because I do need a lot of wood for my house. Right, are you going to cooperate with me? Or are you just going to be a dick? Like, I do not want to be sat here on your back all day. Wait, are you already tamed to me? Wait, hang on, what? Wait, if I could... Oh, yeah, you must be if I can view the inventory. What the fuck? Oh, I, did the... mm. I didn't realise it was tamed to me already. Oh, actually, I'm going to do this just so that I can get some leads. I'm going to kill this guy and his llamas. Oh, my... God damn it. He's gone invisible, little shit. Well, anyway, I got the leads. That's all I care about. Oh, it is spawned. Cool. Right, I'm going to craft a fence post just so that I can keep my horse there. Awesome. 
Oh, I didn't mean to craft that many fences. Oops! You stay there. Oh, awesomeness. I have a horse already this early in the game. This is not something I normally end up doing. Right, well, since I've opened the map like an idiot, where are we? This will be cool. Anyway, um, right, anyway, um, I think that's probably going to do it for this episode. I have a horse already. That's so cool. Uh, I need to think of a name for you. Um, anyway, uh, I think that's pretty much going to do it for this episode. I've been recording long enough and I was going to make a start on my house in this episode, but meh, um, it's already, I think, been going on long enough. So I think what I'm going to do between this episode and the next one is make a start on my house, um, and like do some organizing and stuff, basically do all the boring stuff off camera. Um, so yeah, uh, uh, apart from that, um, I think, yeah, there's not much else to say. Um, let me know down in the comments if you uh, would like to see me do more of this and if, well, I'm hoping that this is something that you will enjoy. Um, because yeah, this is something I've always wanted to do since I started YouTube and I really hope you guys will enjoy watching. So yeah, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, let me know uh, a new world name. Let me know a name for my horse as well. Um, and just let me know in general what you think of this um, and whether you would like me to continue or not because I am loving this. Um, I love Minecraft so much um, and I've always loved it. But anyway, yeah. So as always, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye.